Ronnie is, of course, moving to Vegas very soon. I don't know the exact date. You know what? He's sitting in practically an empty room now with just boxes. And you and Stephanie have been arguing about packing because uh, this is the real rumor I heard. What? Ronnie's out of his fucking mind because it turns out Stephanie's got old pictures of boyfriends that she dated before Ronnie, and yeah, she when ain't she throwing was them. In high school, you know. Yeah, that kind of shit. And Ronnie's all jealous. He wants her to He's throw them out. To that she says she has these photo albums. I said, well, what's in them? And she goes, um, you know, pictures of old boyfriends and family and stuff like that. I go, whoa, pictures of who? And. <laughs> She goes, old boyfriends. I, I said, like, from when? She goes, no, high school and her prom and all this kind of bullshit. You got any pictures of old girlfriends? Well, here's what happened. Before I got married, I was engaged to some other chick. And I had a picture of me. It was like an eight by ten. Like I think my parents took it and had it blown up and shit. And it was in my parents' house. And I, when I was going through shit, I found this picture. I showed it to her because I wanted to show her how different I looked then and everything. And then after I showed it to her, I ripped it up right in front of her and threw it in the garbage. Good for you. And she goes, why'd you do that? Don't you want to save that? And that's how I found out about how oh. uh, Here's Ronnie being interviewed about uh, the situation with Stephanie and her ex-hillbilly boyfriend. What kind of things is she having trouble throwing out? Like albums from old boy with old boyfriends and shit. And she goes, well, what do you care? It's, it's, it's just pictures, and it's from when I was, you know, younger. I'm sure she's probably got fucking cards from them, too. You know, like birthday cards or what, Valentine's Day cards. So I think it's just stupid. I haven't seen this stuff, but I, I don't want to see it. I didn't even ask to see it. So maybe she's keeping, you know, from when I fucking drop dead or something, she could always call them or something. I don't know. So is she going to get to pack all that stuff up? Yeah. Yeah. I let her pack it. Because I talked to my shrink about it, and he goes, what are you worried about? Huh? Well, thank God you got a shrink. The, yeah. I'm the That's fuck down. Her old boyfriend still lives in fucking. He works as or some shit. Yeah, he he made it big in the world. He was he was a uh, in a band or some shit. They thought they were gonna be like the fucking Beatles, I guess, or something. <laughs> that that went real far. The old fucking hillbilly boyfriend, fucking asshole. Then he started complaining that Stephanie's become too independent. What if you threw out all of Stephanie's picture albums and stuff? Would she get pissed, do you think? Oh, yeah. I'd probably wind up throwing her out of the fucking house. Really? Yeah, because we'd wind up fucking probably breaking up. She's very independent, man. She's a very in became even more and more independent as she got older. She too independent for you? Lately, yeah. What are her independent thoughts? Just her in general with her fucking thinking and everything. How dare she think? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, I didn't say... No, stop you know what, Ronnie? Good for you with the shrink. I need to know, are you still working with um, the hypnotist? Yes. yes. And yeah. can he help you with these these feelings about her independence? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Calms me down. Yeah. <laughs> like, like King Kong. They have to, like, <laughs> inject him with a tranquilizer dart. <laughs>